Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Joy of Sticks. Stickhead here with your Atari ST gaming channel, and we're going to have a look, another look at a one-on-one -on -one beat 'em up game for the Atari ST today, and it's Panzer Kickboxing. As you can see, it was uh, made by Futura. I think they're a French company. Um, and interestingly enough, uh, Pascal Yari, there, um, he he coded Load Runner, one of my favourite games for the Atari ST. Absolute cracking job he did on that as well. Oh, nice digital tune, check this out. I like it. Yeah, and the graphics, they're by uh, Marco de Flores. Um, and he's done some graphics for Prince of Persia and Turbo Cup. It's got quite um, a recognisable style, so if you like those games, you might see uh, his style in this as well. <laughs> the music's really good. Check that cock rock guitar. <laughs> I like it. Right, let's skip, please. Won't let me skip. Oh, there we go. Uh, so yeah, I really liked this game as a kid. I remember playing it a lot um, and getting quite good at it. I don't know if I ever beat Panzer. It's basically you you work your way through the ranks. You know, you start at the bottom and you beat a couple of chumps and you work until you get to Panzer. You got to try and beat him to become the world champion. That's because I should say, <laughs> by the way, this game is based on uh, Andre Panzer, a French kickboxer who isn't really very well known here in this country, which is absolutely criminal. And it's probably because he's French. You know what us Brits are like. <laughs> um, but he was he was amazing. Um, so he, he had 114 fights in his career and won 109 of them. So out of all those fights, I only lost five times. Uh, 87 of those wins were by KO. Uh, he was cha world champion six times. Um, and he, not just kickboxing as well, French boxing and judo I think he did as well and he was absolutely Kano at them all. But yeah, just really, really impressive. Anyway, let's have a look shall we? We, should, we might as well just jump straight into a match against Dom Week. <laughs> but yeah, you can see there are different boxes to go through and as you beat each one you win a better and better cup. until you get to Panzer himself. Now you can just fight Panzer from the off, but he'll absolutely kick your ass. Um, the idea is you've got to, you got to uh, win and then uh, train your boxer up. And we'll have a look at the training in a bit, but we might as well get straight into a match first. Um, one of the great things about this game that I really liked was that you could set your own moves. And I think that's select hits bit of a Fringlish uh, phrase there but yeah you can define different moves for each of the joystick directions um, and that was always fun to do here we go we're in round one you can see you start off in a completely empty gym nobody watching you at all apart from this one kid in a cab here <laughs> The first thing I've got to do is get used to the moves, because I had a I had a cracked copy of this back in the day, and obviously someone had changed the moves already. I tripped him over. Oh, that was a big hit. Oh, getting a kick in here. It seems like each move has a, a set effective distance and it's about finding the right one for the right situation. I'm going 
going to land one of those spinning bat fists. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> oh, have that. Yeah, so, I mean, there are lots of different moves. You can move left and right, obviously. Down is um, a block, but what's nice about it is if you if you time it right, which I'm not doing at the moment, you get it doesn't block it; it dodges the hit instead, and obviously you take less damage. I'm not doing too badly. Obviously, it all depends what the judges think more than anything. Yeah, if you get too close to your opponent and don't move, you clinch like that. Oh, no. Oh, it's a nice combo there. There were some really good moves in the uh, cracked version that I have that this boxer just doesn't have, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm going to go for the spinning bat fist knockout. I think that's probably the, the only way I'm going to win this. Oh, oh dear. And I've noticed that if you do the same move three times in a row, the uh, I'll just demonstrate that the ref separates you. Doesn't doesn't like you spamming the same move over and over. Yeah. So I was going to mention that I said that if you press down, you do a dodge. Well, my box is having none of that at the minute. He's not actually doing it. But what you can do is is train up your reflexes so you when you press down your boxer does actually dodge more effectively. Like he the computer control boxer just did one there. He kind of weaved underneath my uh, spinning back fist. Oh, I'm getting a pound in here. Is that it? Three rounds? I've lost that, surely. Yeah. Yeah, more training needed, I think. <laughs> and there's my prize. A first aid box. Why, thank you very much. So, yeah, more training needed, I feel. Let's, um, let's hit the gym. I can only vaguely remember the training, actually. Do you get a choice of different things? I think you do. Let's have a look. Anyway, Don Week gave us a lesson in kickboxing, so uh, we definitely need to improve. Grading, I wonder what that is. Oh, okay. Yeah, that didn't go so well. Not sure if I should be waggling or rotating here. Oh, so close. Did I get it? <laughs> Not sure that I did. Oh, oh come on. <laughs> yeah, you got one. Yeah, so this is obviously uh, how you build up your reflexes. <laughs> Unfortunately, I have old man reflexes. And it's not happening. Right, keep your eye on the stats at the top there. Hopefully they'll go up. <laughs> tiny, tiny little bit. Oh, better than nothing, I suppose. So there you go. That's that's how you train up your boxer and get better. Do you have a look, physical type? Oh, I see. All right. Well, we're not. We're quite evenly matched there. It shouldn't be too bad. Let's see if we can um, define our moves a bit. Oh, 
without the manual this might be a little bit difficult. All right. I don't know what I'm doing. So one, zero, one. See, I want that spinning kick. So if I select it, Do I have to press B? C. Oh, yeah, I think that did it. All right, do I want any more of these? What else did I used to have? I don't know. Are there any more? I'd like to see more. Moves, yes, that's what X means, good. So as you can see, I mean, you can go through all these moves and assign them to any key you like, any input you like. I mean, there's loads of them. It keeps skipping two though, I don't want it to skip two. I'm not sure if I've got this right. Yeah, I, I blatantly don't understand what's happening here. <laughs> yeah, so obviously we need a bit more fiddling around to see what uh, see what that does. I'm pressing Z. Nothing's happening. So let's just quit. <laughs> I might come back to that, see if I can figure it out and get some of the moves that I'm actually used to in this game. All right, let's have another go at Dom Week. See if we can't sort him out this time. It'd be interesting to see if that new move that I put on has actually saved or not, or whether I'm getting it completely and utterly wrong. That is, of course, a chance. <laughs> yeah, so we'll have one more one more match and then uh, we'll get to have a look at the reviews, see how this game did. Right, I'm going to go for the relentless approach this time. Gotta light that uppercut. Oh yeah, here we go. I'm sorting him out now. Oh, where's he going? <laughs> nice block. Oh yeah. We did a bit better that time. Let's see if we can keep the pressure up. Ow. See, the key is getting to know the moves really well so you know what's the effective one to use in any situation. I don't, you see, I don't know these moves at all. A couple of them were in the move set that I'm used to, so I can judge those. But uh, others, not so much. Oh my word, what happened to my lights? <laughs> I thought I was winning. He seems to get his lights back, whereas I don't. 
All right, my 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 recovery in the break seems to be okay. That was a nice sequence though. Oh! <laughs> yes! Get on the canvas, son! I wouldn't get up if I were you. Oh! Let's keep the pressure up. Oh! That was a big hit from him. Oh, he's down again! Oh, I, I love it. <laughs> One of the things I remember being in absolute stitches about. He's down again! Is the sound of the ref? Come on, ref, surely. He's been on the canvas like four times. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I love the sound of that ref. Whoop! No! 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 <laughs> very, very good. There we go, we won one, yes! So which means we now take his title, which I don't know if you saw it on the screen before, but basically looks like a nipple. So yeah, there we go, we won a nipple. Woo! <laughs> well, there you go, that's Panzer Kickboxing and a delightful little game it is too. I did manage to find one review of it, of the ST version, in Zero Magazine. They gave it 84% of respectable score. Um, and they praise the smooth animation and they also like the fact that you can change the uh, the moves and there's a very extensive move set to choose from. One thing it does criticise though is the lack of progression. It says you, you just basically can fight the same person over and over again. Which is true, but then isn't that a bit like real boxing? <laughs> you know, if you want to get better, if you want to raise up the ranks you've got to fight the person ahead of you so like I've just beaten Don Week so I'd go on to the next guy um, I think it's going into a demo or something I can hear it loading but um, yeah oh, get rid of the magazine so you can see this and this is what a a real fight looks like you get you get crowds like this um, towards the end of the game which adds to the um, experience quite a lot. Uh, yeah, anyway, so yeah, they said that you, the progression wasn't there, but really, I think it is. It's just you've got to kind of motivate yourself to beat the next guy and train up and get good enough to beat the next guy. Uh, and I think you can save your progress as well, which is really cool. So I disagree with that. But there you go. That's Panzer Kickboxing. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, if you did, don't forget to leave a like and please make sure you weigh in with the comments down below. I love, love it when we start up a conversation down there. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching, guys. Take care.